Coach Ryan from MaxBP. Today we're going to talk about the pop-up attachment and how you can connect that to any MaxBP pitching machine to create fielding drills and pop-up drills for your players. Most people think of the MaxBP pitching machine as just a hitting training tool, but you can use small ball training in the field or even as a catcher for receiving drills. But today we're going to talk about this pop-up attachment and how you can use it for infielders and outfielders to train on pop-ups and fly balls. It's also great for younger players because it allows them to practice reacting to fly balls without the risk of taking a hard ball to the head if they miss catching it. Let's show you how this thing attaches to the MaxBP pitching machine. You'll notice there's a bolt and a wing nut on this. We're going to go ahead and start by loosening the wing nut and taking that off. The bolt will stay in place. You also notice that there's already a pre-drilled hole in every MaxBP pitching machine where the ball ex exits the machine. First, we're going to slide the bolt into the area where the ball exits and fit it right through the pre-drilled hole. Take your wing nut and screw it back on so that it's connected to the machine. Using the MaxBP pitching machine along with the pop-up attachment is great because it's more consistent than someone trying to hit you fly balls with a fungo into the outfield. Plus, using our mini wiffle balls, which are easily pushed around by the wind, will help your player improve their reactions to every pop-up and fly ball that they'll see. If you have any additional questions about our pop-up attachment and how it fits onto our MaxBP pitching machine, email us at support at maxbp.com.